Nick Diaz, Diego Sanchez. And here we go. While his talents of a fighter will never be doubted, Diego Sanchez was um, a bit of a different personality during season one of The Ultimate Fight. Well, he was very unusual, and I think everybody had to kind of step back and look at him and go, what is this guy all about doing yoga in the rain and, you know, with his hands up at the sky before he fights? Very intense and definitely a very unusual man. Diego Sanchez switches to orthodox. Oh, nice counter left hook right there. Beautiful uppercut. Excellent combination. Oh, wow. looping hook there. Oh, nice uppercut. Big right hand. Oh, he answers. Nice high kick. Swing and a miss. They are both staying in tight, close, right in the fire. And again! He loves throwing that punch. Sanchez switches to orthodox. And now he's answered! Oh, head kick! Oh, but he oh, ate a left hand. Left. Nice right hand. Sanchez is cut open here, Mike. Nice body kick. Inside leg kick. Oh, ducking in and counters that nicely. Fast hands. Good battle inside. Just missed with that one. Sometimes shorter, quicker punches are the way to go. They might not have as much power behind them, but the most important thing is that they land. When a fighter winds up with big bombs, it takes more time for those punches to land. And the shorter, more effective punches are getting there first. Oh, that head kick landed! Nice right hand! Oh, big right hand, he's down! Some nasty ground and pound right there, Mike. Diego Sanchez with the victory. And that's the beginning of the end. Gets on top of him and swarms on him. Look at it from this angle. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at four minutes 56 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO Diego. The Dream Sanchez. Diego Sanchez is the winner.